For the socialist transformation of capitalist industry and commerce, however, a different approach was required. Unlike the socialist transformation of agriculture, a policy of redemption was adopted. Mao Zedong recognized that if the socialist transformation of capitalist industry and commerce was to be successful, China needed to have an understanding of business principles. So, at the end of October 1955, he twice invited representatives of the industrial and commercial community to meetings. He said, our goal is to make our country more developed, wealthier, and stronger. And he went on, by wealthier and stronger, it's with regard to the whole country. The socialist transformation of capitalist industry and commerce was soon gathering momentum. The Wing On department store on Nanjing Road was one of the so-called four great companies of Shanghai. On January the 14th, 1956, the company announced it was entering into a public-private partnership. The company's general manager, Guo Lin Shuang, sang a Cantonese opera piece during the celebration of the change. He said, I may be a lousy performer, but I have a faithful heart. I am expressing my commitment to the socialist road of the CPC. By the end of 1956, the adoption of the public-private partnership model by previously capitalist industrial and commercial enterprises across the country was almost complete. 